my name is Andrew and I'm starting a YouTube channel. Uh, the YouTube channel that I'm starting is all about growth, both professional growth and personal growth. Although I'll probably focus a lot on personal growth, at least at first, because that's really what I'm into right now is a lot of personal growth. Growth has always been a little bit of a passion of mine, even since when I was a kid. Uh, there are things that I look for to grow and to challenge myself and to do differently and to, to progress, to move forward, to learn. I, growth was just it was something that was innate in me, something that I always have had a passion for. But as I've gotten older, it's something I've strived for more and more. Sometimes it's growth in my professional life. Sometimes it's growth in my personal life. Sometimes it's hel helping others grow. Uh, sometimes it's helping myself grow and figuring out ways that I can grow. So this has always been something that's been a passion of mine is this growth. And so I'm starting a YouTube channel on that very topic, growth and how we grow and how we get to a better spot. There are several reasons why I'm starting my own YouTube channel that has to deal with growth, both personal and professional growth. Uh, one of them is to help other people, to help people thrive, to help people reach another level, to help people grow. It's been a big part of my career is to help others. Right now, I'm a director at a company and I help I make sure that my employees are growing. In the past, I've held a lot of instructor type positions, instructor for at-risk youth. I've been an instructor at, in the a local community college. I've been my son's Cub Master, uh, where I've led meetings for Cub Scouts. And so there's personal and professional growth is, has always been something that's been a part and, and ingrained in me. And, and so I desire to help others with that. Another reason why I want to start this YouTube channel is my kids are struggling right now. They're going through a hard time. There's lots of changes that they've been going through these past few years, and it's been hard on them. And so I'm hoping at some point in time, this could be inspirational to them. So uh, if you're watching kids, I love you guys, and hopefully you get something out of this. Uh, and then another reason is for my own personal growth. Um, this is a step for me to kind of sort through my feelings. And I actually have a mission statement to help other people and to help others grow. And so this is uh, helps fulfill a part of what I feel like I'm placed on this earth to do and what is, is part of my motivation in life. So I'm really looking forward to starting this YouTube channel. Um, I'm hoping that it will help other people. And I'm certainly hoping that I will find a bit of myself in this as well. So I figured I'd start out with telling you a little bit about my story, uh, just a brief introduction of who I am, how I grew up. I was pretty shy growing up. I moved to a different school when I was young. And I felt like that played a part in me becoming a very shy person. Uh, I was not a very outgoing person at all. And so I, I am an extrovert. I enjoy being around other people, but uh, there's definitely a shy part of me that um, still comes out to this day. Not nearly as often as it did back then, but uh, yeah, certainly, certainly was a component of that. Um, I, I always, when I was younger, I always challenged myself. I always wanted to grow. I always wanted to try to get to another level. I always wanted to try to learn new things. I remember in high school, I always wanted to uh, take extra classes. I, I figured, hey, this is a free education at this point. So I never took the class where you sat and did homework. I always try to fill in all of my electives uh, so that I was always learning new things. And that carried on through, uh, th through the rest of my life. And I'm still that way today. There's been a few times I've looked back in my life where I've been really challenged. And the way I look at it is if I want to get big and buff and, and or run a marathon, or if I want to physically exert myself and push myself to the limits, I'm going to come away from the gym or from the treadmill or from wherever I'm at sore. It's going to be something that is, is I'm going to feel it. And that's certainly true with personal growth as well. Whenever I expand myself, whenever I challenge myself, it comes with a lot of hurt. And so those times that I have felt like have been the, the deepest hurt in my life or the deepest challenge in my life has been the most growth. Uh, one of those areas that I can think back of that's been really challenging in my life was when I became a survival instructor for the U.S. Air Force. I was a SEER specialist for the U.S. Air Force, in which case uh, I took students out into the woods and taught them how to survive. And I was, I was taking these... Uh, these officers out to the woods 
who thought they were in charge, but uh, you know, I was sitting here an airman in charge of these these groups of people uh, out in the woods and teaching them how to survive off the land. Um, and uh, there were several other components to that training also that I was involved in, which was very challenging. A lot of role play and a lot of things that you had to be on your game. You had to think quickly. And so it challenged me both physically and mentally the whole time. I can tell you that I've reached another level because of that training, because I went through that. Although it was physically and mentally one of the toughest things that I've ever done, I, I would never trade that for anything. It was just such a great experience. Another thing that really impacted my life and really caused a lot of growth is I recently, here a few years ago, went through a divorce. That is by far the most emotional, the most um, depressed I've ever been, the most anxiety that I've ever had, the most down I've ever been, the, the hardest to concentrate, the least amount of sleep that I've ever had. And there's even some, some repercussions of that to, to this day. Um, it is the by far this, the hardest thing that I've ever gone through. But I'll tell you what, I am a better person because of it. There are things that I learned through that that has matured me and has brought me to another level and has given me greater understanding. And the, the self-reflection that I have done through that whole process and the studying of the, how many books I've gone through and how many um, people I've talked to, how many relationships I've built because of that struggle has been amazing. So no one wants to go through a divorce. It's not something that I am proud of. It's not something that, that you know, if, you, if I were to choose, I would not have gone through it. But because of that, I've reached another level and I'm continuing to challenge myself to become a better person. Uh, so it's a continuous struggle, but um, I'll tell you what, it's, once again, it's not something I would have chose, but uh, you make the best of it and you move on. And then the last thing that uh, I would say is one of my big growth areas that I've been really experiencing a lot of growth is, is what, how I've been challenging myself since the divorce. The divorce, a lot of the feelings and a lot of the, uh, the issues from the divorce ha has slowly been subsiding, but there's a lot of challenges that I've been challenging myself. And boy, it hurts. I mean, there are things that, that, that are really causing a lot of pain, a lot of pain to me mentally, a lot of pain to me, I guess, to a certain extent, physically. Um, it's causing problems with sleeping. It's causing problems with um, my concentration. But on the flip side, uh, there's a lot of growth and I am attaining a better level, a next level because of it. So <laughs> this growth thing is difficult. I'm looking for some people that want to grow. And it might be because something externally is being imposed upon you, like a divorce, something that you feel a lot of pain with, but it's your chance to grow, to get to a better level. So I want to help you with that process. I want you to show you ways to get through that and become a better person through all of that. Uh, but it also might be something where you are just bored in life and it's not quite the, you're not quite in the right spot and you're looking for that growth. In which case, if you're willing to bear through that pain, there are some things that you can do to grow to better, to be in a better spot and to, and to live a life that has meaning and purpose. And so I'm going to show whether you're sitting there and struggling by something that's self-imposed or you're ready to take those next steps and to something better, I'm here to be a guide with that, to show you a path, to give some tips and some steps to progress, to move forward, to come out on the other end better than whatever you're going into. So what I'm really looking for in my YouTube channel is some subscribers that don't want to just get to some end goal of something that's uh, you know happy-feely or they get motivated in a short period of time and they make a little progress and then they uh, stop doing whatever it is that they're doing. I'm looking for somebody who's looking for some real growth, some ready to put in the hard work to get to a better level. So if that's you, if you're ready for that type of challenge, click the subscribe button and let's 
take this journey together. Let's, let's get to a better spot. And I'll share with you my journey. I'm going to share with you some other people's journey. Uh, and we're going to just take information from a lot of different sources to come up with how we're going to grow together. And so I look forward to this. I look forward to starting my YouTube channel. I look forward to uh, meeting those who are going to subscribe and grow and hear some of your stories. And uh, let's see where this comes out at the other end. For other great videos and resources, visit lifesurgeacademy.com. Don't forget to like this video if you got something out of it and subscribe to this channel.